Because I want to go to the train station. Like, I should have been able to go up here beforehand, but there was just a long line. Yeah, I can see that. Okay, where do I go to get up here? Up this way. Is there still a long line? No. Okay. It is a pleasant to resist. We'll get up soon. Just give me a bit. W H Y H E L L O. T H E R E I T S Y O U A G A I N H O W H A V E Y O U B E E E E E E E E E E E E E E E E E N Hello, sir, madam. It looks like we won out of train passes, but we still have some lemonade left. Did you want to buy some lemonade? Stop right there. You can't pass without a... Whoa, that's a train pass. You must be the last passengers. We've been waiting for you for a very long time. Well, that's an all clear for me. Welcome aboard, patrons. It's very foggy. You want to board the train? Yes, please. Beep, beep. It's all shadow people. Home is not where here is. Where is home? Here is not where the home is. Where is home? Okay, is this all the same? Yes, yes it is. Okay, I think I have to either go all the way to the left or all the way to the right. So let's go this way. Oh, there we go. Uh, my response was, I agree with that. Oh no, I need to go to the left. Any time now. You might need to, uh, you might need to restart your internet modem if you're, uh, behind. Because that, that usually works for me. I like how, um... I like how everyone else is afraid, but not Amoy. Amy. What is this anyways? Unsure. Jamie, I'm sorry. No idea what that was about. Ladies and gents, we have arrived at our stop. Welcome to Orange Oasis, where the moon shines brighter. Please exit the train in an orderly fashion. Thank you for your patronage, and please ride with us again. Bzzz. Toast. Everyone died. The end. Is it the air sweet here? You can smell the sugar. Yeah, I'm pretty fast, but not as fast as a train. It's important to know your limits. I spy with my little eye a rainbow umbrella with lots of bat with lots of legs. Jump, jump, jump. Orange Oasis. This is a completely optional area, but I do want to show it off. Because there's also an optional boss here too. I'm very unprepared for it, but I'm going to try it regardless. If I can remember how to find it, that is. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Wow, it's a big apple. Hmm. I'm pretty sure it's over this way. But I don't remember. Pancake bunny. As well as milkshake bunny? Milkshake bunny. Oh, okay. Simple enough. About a pancake and cherry soda. Cool. Uh, I believe it's over this way, if I'm not mistaken. Man on fire, you have a worried look in your eyes. I can tell a problem greatly ails you. Let me tell you something, child. When you know that an arduous and difficult future lies ahead, all you need is hope. Be hopeful on yourself, of yourself, and be hopeful of the future. Yes, anything is possible if you behave, and... If all else, else fails, know that at least I will believe in you, alright? Thank you. Excellent! Please accept this teaching as a gift. He will learn spicy food. Now if you'll excuse me, I must be off. Bye! I'm pretty sure it's in one of these graves. But I just don't remember. Um... Before I do that, though, I'm gonna go find a picnic to save. Come back here, man on fire! I'm gonna go find a picnic to save. Um... Should be, yeah, right here. I'm gonna see, uh, where exactly this is, so give me one second. Okay. Hey Amori, guess what? The sand here isn't sand at all. It's brown sugar. Now isn't that sweet? It sure is hot out here though. Remember to stay hydrated everyone. Okay, let's have a picnic. The brown sugar feels good on my feet. I almost want to pick it off and eat it. That's disgusting, Kel. Why would you even think that? You're so weird. We all have weird thoughts sometimes. Kel just doesn't think before he says them out loud. Hey, I consider that a good thing. If you got something to say, then say it. That's just wrong, Kel. You should always think before you speak. Yeah, that's just how the game is. Have some self-awareness. Says who? You, mi you Who says you, Miss Bossy Pants? I have plenty of self-awareness. I know where I am at all, at all times. Yeesh. Loosen up, you two. Balance, guys. It's all about balance. Hero, you coward. That's the laziest answer I've ever heard. I expected better from you. Oh man, what I say now? Poor hero. Okay, now let's save. Um. Apparently, the uh. The code. Where the uh, the thing is in a uh, like a quarry type thing. So I have to find it first. Hmm. Legends speak of a pair of twins who guard the orange oasis under their watchful eye. 
It is said that they have the power to raise the dead, among other things. I don't know if there is much truth about these legends, but wouldn't that be interesting? Oh, it's space pirates. Pluto, come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh, they're still looking for Pluto? A croissant is upside down and struggling to flip over. Flip him? Yes. You flip the croissant over. Thanks. Bye. We'll never see that croissant again. We got Donut. Oh, hi, Orange Man. Hey, uh, what are you doing? My name is Orange Joe, and I'm throwing oranges. Hey, it's the Orange Joe. Well, it's so cool, but why? Because I'm looking for my long-lost twin brother, or Orange Joe. We were separated at birth, but in my citrusy heart, I know that he is still out there somewhere. Each orange is inscribed with a message explaining who I am and how to find me. I am hoping that by throwing these in all directions, one of them will reach him and lead me back to him. Aww, that's so sweet. I hope you will find your brother eventually. Thank you, young lady. I know I will. My body is healthy and full of hope and vigor. But just in case, if you do happen to see my twin, please give him this orange crest. I know it will lead him, lead me to him somehow. Okay, I got an orange crest. Fear not, my dear friend Orange Joe. We'll find your brother for sure. Blood orange. What does that do for me? I have to assume it's an item. Oh, it's a weapon? Oh, that's even- that's just even worse. I don't need that. Okay, where is this area? I don't know. My granddaughter rarely visits, but she sends me a postcard every now and then. She seems to be doing well. I can barely see nowadays, but I can still make out some shapes. I can tell you are all some strange looking donuts. Huh? What was that, Sonny? Did you say something? Okay, cool. Where is this area at? Unsure. Oh, hi. Miss Palmy has been taking care of us forever. She's always been so loving and caring. I wish I could give her something super special. Like what? Welcome to my house. I take care of children who don't have a family of their own. It's been a bit empty around here lately, so I always worry that the children who are left will start getting lonely. Mm hmm. Okay. So there's a bunch of stuff I need to get done. I just don't know how to do it. Okay, so where is this area at? It's got to be around here somewhere. Breadfruit juice. Oh, hey, it's this place. You guys want to get in? Mr. Jossum told me the password once so I could complete one of his errands. I love these guys. They're loads of fun. Oh, so I need to use hero. What's the password? Hey, Hoagie, it's me, Hero. The password is... Hero, my man. Welcome, welcome. Doors unlocked. Come right in. Make yourselves at home, kiddos. Any friend of Hero is a friend of mine. Loosen up a little. Breathe easy. It's time to cool these brain muscles with some tunes. Take a load off on wine. Welcome to Chillville. Me and Hoagie are the owners of this joint. He's the muscle and I'm the muscle. Do I want a lounge with my friends? Yes. Everyone gained five juice. Cool. Oh, interesting. Oh, there's a there's a dude in here. This atmosphere here, the atmosphere here is top notch. I bet Ruben makes some good fruit juice. 
Okay. Where is this area at? It's gotta be around here somewhere. I just don't remember where. I didn't mean to fight these guys, but okay. Oof, overkill much. I do feel kind of bad. What is this? You got a treasure map. Cool. I don't know what that does for me, but okay. Oh, here. Howdy ho, youngins. You don't mind doing me a favor? I need you to scratch an itch for me. It's on my bottom, so I can't really get to it. Ah, it's just absolutely killing me. Okay. So that's where that is. Okay. A hamster with a fanny pack is essentially a small kangaroo. True. Here. You scratch Scott's bottom. Ah, much better. I'll have to come back here. I need to find a certain item in that area. Um, because that'll allow me to get down into the, uh, the area I need to get to. Hey, you must be the kids who scratched my itch. What a huge relief. Here, take this. We actually have too many of these things. I'm sure it'll come in handy one, of, one way or another. Stay safe, kids. I really can't thank you enough. Got a hard hat. What does that do for me? Uh, defense. And that's it. Okay, there we go. Okay, now let's go back into the, uh, the dig site. Actually, I'm gonna save it first. And then I'll go into the dig site. Um... How do I get back around? This way. I didn't mean to fight these guys, but oh well. They're so cute. I'm very hungry too, so it's making me hungry. Everyone grew to level 22, and Hero learned Enchant. I, mean, I need to. I need to check his skills. I don't think any of this is really worth it. No, it's not really worth it. Beard goes. Hmm. Wait, where was I going again? Dang, my memory isn't what it used to be. Gave him a spooky map. Eh, what you got there? A map to old Top Hat's party? Who? it sure is. I better get going before all the food gets cold. Here I come, all you can eat buffet. 69420. Where is this thing? It's gotta be around here somewhere. I think I went too far right. There we go. I 
just want to save it. Come on. Where is this? Where is the save point? There it is. It's a maze. I wish there was like a map that is like, oh, you can actually see it because there's this, but that's not really a map. So let's save. And then I'll go into the, uh, the thing. Oh, nuts. I'm one do dino dollar shy from a silver spoon. According to my law, it says, it says you have a total of zero dino dollars. If you want to buy a spoon, just point it out to me and I'll help you out. Um. Sorry, dude. You don't have enough dino dollars. Okay, so I need to get dino dollars then. How do I get dino dollars? The treasure's on display here are from all over the world. I want to travel around the world someday. Cool for you, buddy. The last time I tried Dino's Dig, I found a lot of amazing treasure. But this time I tried Dino's Dig and I just found some granola bars. Yes, uh, yes I know. The food pyramid has a knack for finding lost things, ancient artifacts, old relics lost in time. The possibilities are endless. Jeez. What kind of Dino shop? Maybe I have to talk with this guy. Hey there, little adventurers. Welcome to Dino's Dig. I'm Dino, the founder of Dino's Dig. Ahem, are you hungry for treasure? Are you ready to have a spoonful of adventure? If so, you come to the right place. Here at Dino's Dig, we have created the ultimate treasure hunting adventure, where you, which you can experience for the low price of 100 clams. Are you ready to enjoy the fun and excitement of digging for treasure? Dino-tastic. Okay, but how do I get them, though? Hmm. Alright kiddos, first things first. Here at Dino's Dig, we dig with spoons. Since you don't have a spoon, I'll give you a potato spoon for free. You got a potato spoon. Choose which spoon you'd like to choose first. What you'd like to use. Potato spoon. There you go, right on brother. You're a quick learner, aren't you? In our special dig site, the food pyramid, you'll be able to uncover super rad treasures from all over the world. All over the universe. And the best part is, you get to keep anything you find. That's a dino guarantee. Let me tell you about our dig site. The food pyramid has four levels. You always start on the first level, but if you're lucky, you might just find a pyramid key that unlocks the pyramid gate to the next level. The higher you go, the better the treasure will be. Now here's the catch. Each spoon has a limited amount of uses before it breaks. For example, potato spoons will break after you dig five times. If your spoon breaks, the treasure hunt ends, the pyramid gates close, and we will call you back to the entrance. You understand everything I've said so far? Yes. Dino-tastic. Now it's time for our Dino Disclaimer. Treasures isn't the only thing that you'll find in the food pyramid. During your round, you might find some troublesome critters looking for a fight. We aren't liable for any damages to you or your property during your adventure, you dig? If a critter knocks you out during battle, it'll be a real game over. Well, that's pretty much it. All that's left for you to do is go up these stairs, smell the sweet food pyramid air, and start digging. 
Have a Dino-tastic adventure. Okay. Um, I need to find a certain item. Okay, I got five Dino Dollars. Another spoon bites the dust. Big spoon down. That's game over. Did you find a lot of cool treasures? I hope you enjoy your Dino-tastic adventure. Seven dollars. If you want to buy a spoon, just point out to me the ones you want. Want to buy a wooden spoon for six dollars? Yes. Yeah, wooden spoon. Sick choice. I hope you find lots of treasure. I need to find a certain item that'll give me the code for what I need for that graveyard. Have a dino tastic adventure. I don't know what the drop rate is for him though. Hey, I found Hector! It's about time. Oh, Hector! Could it be? It's really you! Come on, Hector! Back into my pocket you go! It'll be just like old times! Ah, Kel, my old friend. I am so sorry. I'm afraid things have changed and I can no longer accompany you. You see... I have a family now. What? Wait, Hector Jr., what are you doing? Are you saying that you want to join them? But there's more to life than just staying here? Oh, Hector Jr., I I understand you well. Even this old stone knew, knew how to have fun once. May you all have memorable adventures together. Go on and join him, Hector Jr., into his pocket. We got Hector Jr. Yeah, just like that. I guess this is farewell then. Thank you for never giving up on finding me, Cal. Hector Jr., you be good, okay? Don't forget your family. We're always here for you. I hope that the next time we meet, you'll have flourished into a wonderful polished rock. Don't worry, Hector. I'll take good care of Hector Jr. I know you will, Cal. Just don't lose him this time, alright? I won't. I promise. Well, losing... losing him is... the best thing that ever happened to him. Got fries. Fries. I have to fight this guy because he's in my way. Ow! Stop. Oh my god. Thank you. Wow. That was not good. A 
need... certain item. I don't know where to get it though. Like I don't know if it's a certain level or if it's just completely random. Pyramid key, there we go. Um I should probably just double check. Um which is what I'm gonna do. Give me one second. I'm, I need to double check. Another spoon bites the dust. Big spoon down. Okay, so I have the, uh, the ancient code now. One, two, three, four. Okay. buy some of these. Let's buy like 12 of them. Who didn't invent this? Okay. I want to heal. I want to save. And then I'm going to go see if I can go down into the area. I don't think I'm ready for it, but I'm going to try it anyways. And then, um, then I'll call the episode for now. I say the episode, I mean the stream. That scared me for some reason. Like, I already ran into him. Okay, so it's one, two, three, four. There we go. This is a completely optional area that's very missable. But it has one of the best, uh, best, uh, music in the game. Do you want to poke the big toast? Yes. Oh-ho! 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 I was joking when I said when I like made that noise. Like it reminded me of like the Delta Rune, like boo. <laughs> Ew! What is all this? This this is all purpose flower. <laughs> uh, my nose is all itchy. Stop right there, no goodies. Can't you read directions? You should all be ashamed of yourselves. My family and I have been guarding this crypt's treasure for generations. But guarding it ain't easy because of people like you. I may be old and frail now, and my eyesight might not be so good, and I may be the only one left, but I've spent a lifetime doing this, and I've gotten real good at guarding, I reckon. I can't even remember what I'm guarding, but it's probably whatever's hidden in that important looking safe in the left corner of the room. Anyway, I'm gonna have to ask y'all to leave peacefully. Being an actual mole and all, I can dig my way out of here in three seconds flat. There ain't nothing special about this place. So how about I save you all the trouble and get you out of here? No. 
You want to stay and enjoy the place? Alright, if you insist. Feel free to look around and all. This summoning circle may be old, but it still works like a charm. But no funny business, or else. Don't you even think about opening that safe. There's definitely no combination or anything like around these parts. I don't know what the code is. You feeling the to get back to the surface? You won't be able to take anything you find from the counters here with you. That's okay, partner. Um, the perfect spot for a sacrifice. I think I have to use the blow. No? Sesame slice and sourdough, nice. I'll just do that just in case. I wanted to make sure I was doing this right. Oh! Seven. Okay, so I have to fight each one. So I'm gonna do, uh... Do that, do that. Um, I need to do this. Uh, snacks. Seven two zero. One. Nine. Seven two zero one nine. Six. Seven two zero one nine six. Nine. Seven. Two, zero, one, nine, six, nine. I found a recipe for disaster. Take it. Yes. Ingredient: sprout. Like not sprout. The mole. 
maybe no be there may be no turning back. Yes. What in tarnation? He picked up actual mole. For it, wait for it. There we go. Portal has been opened. I don't know if I'm gonna win this fight, but I'm gonna try regardless. Oh god. You died. Oh, I don't think there was any winning that. Okay. Got life jam, life jam, and life jam. Amoy, oh you saved me. Thank you, I thought it was toast for sure. Ah, where am I? Oh, hey guys, what I miss? Ugh. Welcome back, Hero. What, how are you feeling? I feel dizzy. Whoa, whoa. Hey, where are we? I don't know. Maybe a place where all abandoned toast goes. Well, we sure as heck aren't toast anymore. Let's hope we can find a way out of here. Okay. Ah. Uh, well, god dang it. I just wasted items. Like, if need be, I can always just go back to that one. We're in Brevin now. Today's menu, fresh bread. Tomorrow's menu, fresh bread. Reminds me of the, the bread shop in the faraway town. Oh ho! Biscuit. Doughy. Oh, oh ho. Oh ho. So they're like animating uh, bread. We were born to make bread forever, day in and day out. Fresh bread, fresh bread, fresh bread. It's a hard life. And it's not very rewarding, but this is all we have. We just have to be grateful, right, Biscuit? Oh-ho! That's right, brother. This has always been our life. Trapped in an endless circle of bread. Oh-ho! 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 So this is where the wailing was coming from? Aye. Ah! The bread! It has spoken! I knew that our bread would come back to haunt us eventually. Come, Biscuit, we must destroy them before they destroy us first. Wait a second, we're not... Oh ho Oh-ho! oh ho Ah, I love this song, too. A lot of the bosses' themes go really hard. They attack together. Oh my god. Okay, bye! Bye, hero!
Yeah, there's no way I'm winning this fight. Wait for it. So good. Bye, Audrey. Fresh bread, fresh bread. Every day it's fresh bread. Oh ho! Became sad. You can only become happy or angry. Put some fresh bread out, out of the oven. Drums are great. Please stop. gonna be a very very close fight I don't have much life jam though so that's gonna be the the factor that matters the most we're doomed to break bread for all eternity aren't we biscuit oh -ho. Bye, Kel. Are you kidding me? I'm screwed. I'm screwed. There is no freaking way.
Bye, Aubrey. Oh my god. They're starting to hit like a truck. I need to be able to get the attack off. That's my problem. Get something in the oven. Thank you. Same. We're running out of supplies. What do we do, Biscuit? Oh, we came to press. Okay. Um. As long as they don't heal, I should be okay. We'll run everything. We have almost nothing left. Oh, miserable. They have to have like an ultimate attack or something that's gonna screw me over. Um, 
Yeah, no damage. That's not good. There we go. Oh, why, why did I not do the ultimate attack? I'm stupid. Crap. Oh, they made a cooking and recovered one heart. Nice. If I get this ultimate attack off, I think I win the battle. No, not you. Yes, I win. I think I win. I was very underleveled. Unless they got nerfed. But I don't think they did. Huh, it's snowing outside. Just noticed. Huh. 1500. Yeah, I won. Our resources have been depleted. What will we do without ingredients? Oh. 18,711 XP. 10,445 clams. And everyone grew from level 21 to 25. Nice. Their theme goes hard. I like Sweetheart's theme better, but this one is my second favorite. <sighs> We're all out of juice. It seems that this is the end for us, Biscuit. Oh, wait. We're not bread. We're kids just like you. You, you mean you're not here to destroy us? Of course not. We would never attack unprovoked. You hear that, Biscuit? We're saved. Now it's head... Let, now it's back to baking. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. Oh. Hey, so uh, how long have you guys been break, baking bread here? Don't you want to go outside and get some fresh air? Oh. If only that were possible. We've been trapped here since the inception, since the inception of the universe. Wow, that sounds like a pretty long time. I think you both deserve a break. What? That's preposterous. What meaning do our lives have if we do not spend it breaking bread? Uh oh? If we were to leave our bread bread making stations, what would we do with ourselves? This is the only life we know. And yet, my morbid curiosity overwhelms me. That portal up there was able to d transport us out of this place. We used to count we used it countless times to fulfill our bread summonings, but we have never seen the other sides for ourselves. There was somebody um online that said it's like morbidly depressed baker is what I strive to be. Well we have. Let me tell you, it's a big awesome world out there. I think it's about time that you guys start exploring new possibilities. Hmm, tempting. Well, what do you think, Biscuit? Oh, Mm-hmm. I'm listening. Mm-hmm. Yes. But... Ah. That is true. Alright, we've changed our minds. We want to leave. This place sucks. Oh, Biscuit. We've always been afraid to use the portal. But perhaps it's time for change. Come on, brother. Let's experience our first taste of freedom. Oh, ho! What, did they have a ladder there the entire time? Nice. 
Um, I don't think I can go uh, do the other fights that were down there, but I don't really care either. I'm glad I got that done. Okay, I'm going to go save and then I'll call it for now. Where did they... Where did they go is my question. Bread phones. What does that do for me? There they are. Um... Oh, those probably would be better <laughs> for Aubrey. One less defense, but ten heart. Mm. Eh. I feel like it's the charm of the characters. It's like sweethearts, like oh. <laughs> I want to go save and heal. <laughs> there we go. I was going to say, is you not dead yet? The surface of the water is shimmering. Do you want to stare at it intently? I, I love their designs too. I like a lot of the uh, the designs of the bosses. Rain Town. Where am I? Oh, there's another picnic. Um, I think I'll save and save this for next time. Um, I'll have a picnic first. This is so calming. Hmm, yummy. Thanks for the soup, Mari. This soup is slurp delicious. Can I have some seconds, please? What's wrong, guys? Is there something wrong with my soup? Ah, lazing around in the rain is fun and all, but eating in the rain is a whole nother thing. I can't tell where the rain ends and the soup begins. Aw, poor dudes. Okay, let's heal. Ah yes, yeah, some hearty soup. Okay, save. Gotcha. 